annual Credit Suisse Asia Investment Conference is underway. Uh, our, our Nimesh Shah is at that conference and he caught up with Santitaran Satiratan, the Asia Economics Research Head at Credit Suisse. He began by asking him if uh, he expects more rate cuts from Reserve Bank and how he reads the policy. Yeah, we actually think they might be on a pause now. So okay. it is a question of whether they can, whether they have the space, and whether they really have the need as well. Okay. I think they have a space, and right now we are in a little bit of a sweet spot in EM where sure. the Fed high expectation is pushed back, yeah. growth China stabilizing, capital flows is in favor of high yields like India or Indonesia. Sure. But so they have room. But it's a question of the need. If they're successful in getting the rate being transmitted to lower lending rate, lending rates then probably the need to do much more aggressive rate cuts is not really there. Okay. Plus, um, RBI also wants to balance the rate cuts to boost growth with objective of reshoring all the uh, financial savings to the household sector. Sure. But do you think with, 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 with the rate cuts that RBI has done so far, uh, this will really lead to uh, growth? Because that, that is still missing, right? That growth is still not picking up in a lot of the pockets. Do you think with the rec recent move by RBI, there is a stimulus for the growth to also improve? Yeah, I think with a bit of a lag time, this should um, translate into a better improvement in real economy. I would keep a close eye on, especially on consumption as a driver. Okay. So as investment, there's a lot of other factors like the global certainty, the debt level, the banks, how much they can really translate this to greater lending. But in consumer space, they have a relatively low leverage. Their own consumers benefit from low inflation, and there's some pent-up demand there. So that's going to be the space that could benefit from these rate cuts.